Hi, my name is Jan Zaleski, and I had bariatric surgery through MidMichigan Medical Center Gratiot in June of 2017. I've always had a problem with my waist since I was young, and we tried everything from dieting to just cutting back on foods and trying to eat vegetables and fruits, and as I got through high school, I got bigger and bigger. I would gain uh, a few pounds, I would lose 25 pounds, I'd gain it back, I'd lose it, and I did, I did everything. I exercised and did everything I could to, to try to lose the weight, and I knew that weight issue would be a, was a problem with my family because my father had weight issues, my mom had, my sister, my brothers. And I looked at that and I did not want to end up being heavy and overweight and not being able to chase, chase my grandkids, which we, we do so much together and they're everything. You know, every time I would, I would get up to move, my legs hurt, my knees throbbed, I had shortness of breath, and I just didn't want to be that way. Um, I work for Michigan Physicians Group Cardiology. What really helped me make my decision was I see a lot of patients that are overweight that are having problems moving around, um, their shortness of breath, they're walking with canes. And I looked at myself and I, I seen that and I said, you know, I, I don't want to be there. Um, I'm 62 years old and I wanted to take charge of my life. And so I went ahead and I seen my doctor and I consulted her and, and asked her if there's any way that, you know, I could maybe get some help maybe with bariatric surgery or, or maybe she could refer me to a surgeon. That's where my journey began. After my doctor referred me to uh, Dr. Bonacci, um, I met with him um, and explained kind of what was going on with my, my weight issues. And he said that I was a perfect candidate for it because I was healthy. He said, you are really a perfect candidate just because of your, your BMI being so high. So that's kind of where, the, where it began. And he asked me, when do you want the surgery? And I said, right now. Um, after I met with Dr. Bonacci, I met the support team, great group of people. We talked about different ways of exercise, different types of food to eat, where I would be um, going in the next few months in my, you know, in my journey. I had my surgery, um, it was June 14th, and I was ready to go home right after. I was in surgery for a couple hours, everything went well. Um, I was ready to go home, and they said you can go home the next day. So I stayed overnight, and in the morning, they went over everything with me, what was expected, and what I'd be going through in these next few weeks, and I went home. But once I got home, I had to, to uh, look at all my uh, brochures that was given to me from my support group to see what I should be eating and what I should not be eating, and to be sure that I'm getting all my protein in during the day. I started losing, you know, a couple, two, three pounds a week, and there would be one week I'd lose a pound, one week maybe two, one week I wouldn't lose any. But it started coming off and within, you know, six, six months or so, I lost 40 pounds. Um, as for today, I feel wonderful. Um, I have lost 70 pounds. I feel great. I, I get around, I chase my grandkids. It's easy for me to do pretty much anything. I do a lot of walking, you know, try to keep exercising. I go on my treadmill, which I could hardly even do that before. I'm always busy. I'm very energetic, but I feel, I feel 100% better. My name is Angela Hathaway. I had the bariatric gastric sleeve surgery through MidMichigan Medical Center Midland, and I've lost 134 pounds. I am a wife to my husband, Keith, and I have two little boys. I've had problems with my knees since I was uh, junior high age, and they were just getting worse. Problems with my back. Everybody suggested maybe if I got the weight off, it might help with my problems. I actually was with my family physician, Dr. Paul Berg, and he was helping me out with one of my foot problems. And I said, well, I've heard that being overweight affects your feet and all your joints, of course. And he suggested that maybe I should look into gastric surgeries. The first six months after my procedure was a difficult time because you're still not allowed to eat a lot of things. But progressively, as the weight kept coming off, I got so much more energy. I was actually doing 5Ks, was able to play with my kids, and I didn't mind going shopping or doing all those normal things that a lot of people take for granted because I was always too tired to do them. I was able to do the things that normal people would do and actually enjoy them. When people ask me about bariatric surgery, I don't really sugarcoat it. I let them know that it is not easy. It is a tool to help them, and that with some hard work and dedication to the program that is outlined to them, that they can be very successful, and it's rewarding, and it's the best decision I ever made. Back in 2000, when I moved from Brazil to, to America, to US, uh, I was 42 years old, and uh, my weight was around 220 pounds. But during the period of uh, 14 years, I, I gained a lot of weight due 
mainly to the fact that here we eat much more food. The fact that I didn't do any physical activity to offset this, uh, I start adding weight. And uh, like I said, in 14 years, I moved from 220 pounds all the way up to 310 pounds. That's when I decided that this thing uh, uh, should stop and I should, I should change the, the way it was going to. With the weight gain came a variety of uh, health issues. Um, the, the most critical one was type 2 diabetes. I also, doing my weight, I had back pain, knee pain, and, and uh, I snore. I had sleep apnea, and uh, this whole thing was adding up to a point that I, I could not manage anymore. I chose to have the, the surgery at the Mid Michigan uh, Medical Center in Midland because uh, my colleague at work had the same surgery with the same team, and he was very successful in his, in his surgery, and I was impressed with the results. So I went to attend a seminar, and one of the coordinators explained us how this thing works and the several the, the different options of surgery, and uh, I chose for the um, sleeve gastrectomy because I, I found during my research and conversation with the doctors that would be a more definitive uh, solution compared to the other options. Even though all of them has their benefits, I, I chose to be more radical and say, okay, if I have this uh, uh, sleeve gastrectomy. It is a kind of a no way back. So I would reduce my stomach size. I will be forced to eat less and more frequent. And I will have to be educated in terms of uh, what kind of food to eat and eat more healthy and etc. So that was uh, uh, what I decided to do. And a couple of months later, like uh, uh, around July in that same year, I found this uh, Taekwondo school in the Midland Mall and I decided to join and uh, to have an activity that I could commit with time. It requires a certain uh, abilities in terms of uh, agility, flexibility, elasticity, dedication. Um, uh, all of these together with a physical fit uh, preparation. And uh, during my tenure of being prepared and moving from belt to belt to belt, I saw other people that, that uh, was part of the group that I, I, I go in this school, going to competition. And uh, we have this group going right now. We have nine students and four or five of them came from the bariatric surgery. So it's very, very, very rewarding. The surgeries changed the way I eat, uh, primarily by limiting the size, the amount of food that I can, I can uh, eat. Uh, for me, uh, having the bariatric surgery was the best thing that happened uh, in my recent life. Uh, I was going, like I said, in the wrong direction, and bariatric surgery put me back on track to be healthier, to remove all of those uh, 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 issues, health issues that I had. And uh, today I'm a healthier person. I'm happy. I like the results. If I have to do it again, I definitely would do it again. Hi, I'm Gail Gorman. Five and a half years ago, I had bariatric surgery, and I've lost 192 pounds. And I'm her husband, Ron, and I had surgery done in 2012, bariatric surgery, and I've lost a little over 200 pounds, and I've managed to keep that off. I decided to have bariatric surgery um, when I started getting really, really heavy. My father died at 52 from a massive heart attack, and I was afraid that if I didn't do something drastic and permanent, I was going to follow in those shoes. And I weighed 426 pounds. I was on four different blood pressure medicines. I had a very difficult time getting around, uh, being athletic at all. And my doctor told me, he said, if you want to see 60, if you want to see grandkids, you need to make some decisions. Bariatric surgery has changed my life drastically. When I weighed 426 pounds, I was not healthy and couldn't do the things that I'm doing now. We own horses and we horseback ride and uh, now I have no trouble jumping up in the saddle and being able to do the things that I couldn't do then. We have done three half marathons together. We've done many 5Ks. Getting down and playing on the floor with my granddaughter or when she says, hey grandma, will you play tag with me? And being able to actually get up and run has just been fantastic. Having the surgery is 
the beginning step. It's a tool, but it takes a lot of commitment and a lot of time from, from you to go ahead and do the exercising and change the eating habits and in realizing that it's going to just make your life so much longer, so much richer. My advice to somebody that is thinking about it would be to get educated, go to some meetings and find out, and then make some smart, rational decisions about what you want to do. If somebody was considering and thinking about having the weight loss surgery, I would say do it sooner rather than later because you are missing out on some wonderful time of having the weight gone, having your body feel good, and, and just um, living life to the fullest that you should and deserve to have. My name is Joe Monahan. I've lost over 135 pounds after bariatric surgery. I was an air traffic controller for over 32 years. With that job comes a lot of stress, rotating shifts. You never seem to get on a constant regimen of when you eat, when you sleep. So over the course of that career, I gained over 100 pounds. I weighed 322 pounds. I'd given up pretty much on everything I enjoyed doing. I tried every way you can think of to lose weight. I tried Atkins, Weight Watchers, South Beach Diet, counting calories, you name it. I, I, I tried it, and I'd have a certain level of success with all of it, but I could never stay on it. And the end result would be I'd wind up gaining more weight than I lost. After failing at every diet I could possibly find, I finally started to look at bariatric surgery. I did a lot of research. I wanted to make sure that I knew exactly what I was getting into. I had the procedure at MidMichigan Medical Center. I had zero complications. I was in the hospital for three days. They took fantastic care of me. Bariatric surgery gave me my life back. Within about five months, I'd lost over 110, 115 pounds. The pain in my knees stopped. The pain in my hips stopped. I no longer had acid reflux. And I no longer had high blood pressure. After losing the weight, I now can do anything I want to do. I feel 25 years younger. People come up to me all the time and say, I would not recognize who you were if I didn't know who you were. And I always laugh and say, that's okay. I don't recognize who I am every morning when I look in the mirror. It's, it's truly a, a, a gift to have your life given back to you like this. Everything about this surgery is about changing your life. And a lot of changing your life is making better decisions. Bariatric surgery is not a diet. It's nothing that you just go out and think, well, let's give this a try. It's a complete change of your life. It's not a miracle. It's a tool. But the results can be miraculous. My name is Bruce Olson. In the years since I've had my bariatric surgery, I've lost over 110 pounds. My cardiologist actually suggested I look into bariatric surgery. I was dealing with some serious issues. I just couldn't get the weight under control by myself. I'd reached a critical point and I needed help. I started my process by attending one of the seminars sponsored by MidMichigan Health. Surgery is not something you should rush into. Take it one step at a time, learn the pros and cons, and make your own decision. As far as the actual surgery is concerned, everything went just like clockwork. And through my day and a half stay at the hospital, I couldn't ask for anything better. Uh, since my weight loss, I have found it uh, more convenient to do work around the house, especially doing special projects for people. It's just so much fun to be able to do things and not get tired. Uh, the current project I have right now is a concession trailer for the Masonic Lodge. I also uh, have a project I was asked to work on by the parade chairman for the Ladies Auxiliary of the Eagles. It just gave me something to do because I have all the tools to do it and the freedom of movement to do it. I feel like the surgery saved my life. <laughs>